Good morning, year four and year five. How are you? Today we are going to revise some tips and common errors. Now, let's read this together. Justin is preparing for a Byron performance this weekend. He practiced for 254 minutes on Monday and 133 minutes on Tuesday. So how many more minutes did Justin practice on Monday than Tuesday? I'd like you to have a look at this answer. Yes, it's wrong. What is wrong here is this sign. We are not going to add 254 with 133, but we are going to subtract them, right? As it's written down here, how many more? We are comparing between which, between two things, so we are going to subtract. Good job. So whenever we read the word how many more, I'm going to subtract. Now, if I'm going to change the last part, which is going to be he practiced on Monday and Tuesday. For example, let's go back. It's written down here. Instead of how many more minutes did Justine practice on Monday than Tuesday? No, we are going to change it to be how many minutes did he practice on Monday and Tuesday? So this means we are going to, yes, add both numbers because he wants here Monday and Tuesday. What if I changed how much longer? What if I change it into how much longer? Again, we are going to subtract. Good job. What if we go down on which day did he practice more? By how much? Let's go back. On which day he practiced more? He practiced on Monday, 254, and he practiced on Tuesday, 133. So, yes, definitely, he practiced more on Monday. And it's written down here, by how much? By how much means that, again, I'm going to subtract and then find the difference. Good job. Now, let's go to, to some tips in division. In division, we all know that I always start with the bigger number, right? I can say 27 divided by 3, and I cannot say 3 divided by 27, right? Good job. Now, regarding doubling and halving, when I say a quarter of anything, we know this tip. We find half of the half. Good job. And if I said anything multiplied by 4, I find double the double. It's another trick. What about doubling alone? When I double a number, it is same as multiplying it by two, right? When I say double two, it's four, which is same as two times two. And here, halving. Halving is same as dividing. Dividing by two. So when I find half of any number, same as if I'm dividing it by two. Good job. 